Hi there, it's Janice Thompson from JazzleDazzleCrafts.com. I'm an independent Stampin' Up! demonstrator and I work in Scotland. At the weekend, I, as I probably, if you've followed my videos, you'll have heard already that I have just been at our Stampin' Up! biannual conference, which was held in Telford. Um, I'm not quite sure exactly where Telford is, it's down south. <laughs> we flew into Birmingham and then we had an hour's train ride to Telford. So um, my geography is pretty shocking for of that area. Um, but anyway, it's down, it's down south somewhere. So at that event, it's called On Stage. All demonstrators got together and the company... Um, basically rolled out the new catalogue which goes live at the beginning of June to customers. If you're a demonstrator you will be able to order from the catalogue starting at the beginning of May. Now I'm allowed to show you lots of things but what I can't show you at the moment is the actual insides of the catalogue. You can see the outside. It's gorgeous so it gives you some exciting ideas. What I will be able to show you over the next week or two is some of the products that I that the company gave me and I will be able to show you some of the things that I've made with these products and also from the make and takes that I did on the day as well with that um, it's a great crafting experience that we get when we're there so um, I'll be able to show you some of them but today what I've done what what I'm here to show you is all the swaps that I got while I was there. I'm desperate to look into them so I thought I'd share that with you. So this will probably be a long video and it's up to you, you can fast forward whatever. So what happens at these type of events is all the demonstrators take, this is completely optional but you can take along some items to swap. Now I made these boxes and inside, I haven't done a video for this, so if you want me to do a wee video for this, let me know. And if there's a demand. So I made a, this little box. This little box is actually designed by my team leader in Stamping Up, Karen McDonald. She is Cory Paper Crafts. She operates under. And she showed me how to make this dinky wee box and the measurements that go with it. And then, of course, I've just designed my own belly band to go over it and made it like for Easter. So for this I used, what did I use you tell me? Brain Freeze again. Fable Friends. Is it Fable Friends? Somebody tell me. I've just put it away and I can't see it. I, I have put it on my shelf literally a few minutes ago. Fable Friends. Cling stamp set. I'm so, so pleased to tell you this is actually carrying over to the new catalogue. Delighted. I just got it because it had the Easter greetings stamp in it and I was needing to make some Easter greetings. It is absolutely fabulous and I can't explain why I didn't get it before. I've only really used this. One of my ladies that comes to class has used these ones. Not used the rest. So, well, Easter greetings I have used. But these are so cute, see, so, you know, baby cards, children's birthday cards, etc. Um, happy spring, glad we're friends, darling baby. So, do you know, for a new baby, fantastic. I say, it's a great set and it's a great set for colouring in. So, as you see, I've coloured this in with a combination of my marker pens and my blends. But I had such fun making those boxes. I made 60 of them, one or two left which I'll use as gifts over this coming weekend when I see um, my grandchildren, my nieces and nephews, well, great nieces and nephews. So I'll pop that away. Now, on the Saturday, I already have showed you a video of this and there is a blog to show you um, the cards that I made for Saturday for the actual event. On, on the Saturday was the company event and on the Sunday I went to a team event, a larger, you know, a, te a larger team than myself that I'm part of. So I went along to that one. So the boxes were swapped on the Sunday. The cards were swapped on the Saturday, however... There were 600 plus 
demonstrators there on Saturday. And most of you who know me know that I have hearing loss and I also suffer from tinnitus. Well, I don't suffer from it, I live with tinnitus. But when I go to a big gathering like that, where are there are lots of people, I get a bit overwhelmed. Um, and that is what happened to me on Saturday. I just got a bit of overwhelm and I didn't get myself out there swapping with the ladies. However, lots of ladies came by the table where I was and I did swap with them. But I do have quite a number of cards left over. Whoops. So I am actually offering an online swap. I've got loads of cards left over. So on my anyone who wants to go onto my Facebook or any of my other social media, let me know that you're willing to swap a card with me, any card that you want to make. If you let me know that, I will privately give you my postal address. If you give me yours, I will post you out one of these many cards that I've got left from my swap. So we can make it an even larger swap. Just a card, do you know, just pop to pop in. I will, as I say, I will gladly swap these with anyone who wants to. I love to put a message on my phone, uh, social media, but get in touch with me. You know, I'm on Pinterest, I'm on Facebook, I'm on Instagram. I, you can message me down below to start the process. Um, I've got email. I'm janice.mcglen at gmail.com. Um, the link to all that is down below. So just get in touch with me. E email's fine as well if you're not on social media. So anyway, enough of that. Just As I say, I will swap with anyone who wants to swap by post. What I'm going to do is bring in... The swaps and things I got while I was away. So I've got two baskets. I'm going to tip this one out. Um, I'm going to tip it out at the side here. Whoops, see? The side of me here. And put the basket at the other side. And as I've talked about each thing, well, I might have to do two videos or make this just a long one. So here I have, oh, this beautiful little box from one of my Stampin' Up! friends. Um, this is from Helen Slim, who, uh, well, I know as her as Helsey, and she is slimandstylish.com. So if you want to have a look at Helsey's blog, just have a look at Slim and Stylish. Helsey actually did a demo, uh, a product, well, 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 whisper, a product spotlight. So she was given some of the new products from the catalogue earlier this year and she prepared a demonstration and I'm totally in awe of her. She, she's not been a demonstrator for two years yet. She's done fantastically. She's an amazing stamper and she, she got up in front of 600 fellow demonstrators and did an amazing demonstrator and spotlighted one of our new products. I'm not going to spoil it. Have a look in her blog because she tells you all about it there. So if you want to see some more project, some more new product, go to slimandstylish.com and have a look. Look, so she's used the scallop punches here and the little itty, the little flowers. I always call them itty bitty. That's an old set, but beautiful and one of our beautiful diamonds. He's absolutely beautiful. It's so cute. Anyway, if I talk this much about each thing, we'll be here for absolutely hours. But I will, you know, sorry if I skim past some people, but I, I love them all and I appreciate them all. Oh, here's a card and a style I love, inking up the embossing folder. And this embossing folder is fantastic. And also it's carrying on over into the new catalogue. And this is from... A German demonstrator I believe we had. So this is Lola Lorenz. She's from Munich and she shared our day with us on Saturday. It was lovely to meet you Lola um, and thank you for your swap. So this is 
she used Best Bunny and Amazing Life. And as I say, the country floral dynamic textured embossing folder. That is some, some um, mouthful. Beautiful, though, beautiful. Uh, with the cake builder and the cake builder punch. So pretty, look, she's used some of the same embossing folder there. So this is Handmade with Love by Alison. Alison, you haven't said if you've got a blog or anything. I'll just have a wee look. I'm sorry, there's no details of a blog or anything here. Alison, whoever you are, thank you very much. That is really pretty. Beautiful. I don't have the Cake Builder Punch, but I believe it's carrying over too, so there you go. And the text, the subtle textures with the stitch shapes, that just works. Subtle textures, look, she's used that embossing folder there and here and then the floral dynamic one so good use of embossing folders excellent another card here i'm just taking it just simply to make some whoa f for friend on lots i, I believe shimmer paint now this punch is carrying over these large letters are not but this flower is this flower's a uh, stamp and punch are your starburst is co oh, coming over so this is Elizabeth Bennett, thank you very much. And it's Liznig at AOL, AOL .com. I'm just no no blog details but beautiful. I'm not going to read out everything people have used, but if you did want to know about anything, get in touch and I'll let you know. Liz obviously doesn't have a a blog that she wants to share with us. Oh my goodness, what oh gosh, three Easter rabbits. Are my grandchildren going to be lucky when they come by at the weekend? All these wee bits of Easter things. I'm going to make them a bag each and I'm going to share out all my Easter goodies with them. And that was why I wanted to uh, have a look. If I unfold this, I'll never get it folded again, but I'll try. Oh, this is a bit German too, I think. Rui Boos, tea it is, it's a Rui Boos, wow. So this is, oh we've got this at the, the um, Putler team event from Yvonne who came and joined us and she's also from Germany. Purple Ivy Crafts, thank you so much, that's really lovely and thank you for swapping with me. So, How are we going to do this? I am not very clever at these things, but I'll try. Whoops. <laughs> What's the chances of me getting that back in there? That's clever. I've never done one of these, so I will be copying this one. It's really a nice effect on lets you see both sides of the paper. And thank you for the wee sweeties, how sweet. Oh gosh. Right. A wee handbag it's come open. Things have been a bit bashed on the way home, but um, enjoy today. Who have we got this from? Kath Drinkwater. Thank you so much, Kath. And a beautiful little ladybird, isn't that sweet? I love this wee handbag, it is really clever, using the tag topper punch as well. And the smallest of the scallop punches. Yep, be copying this wee handbag as well. So what we will, do you know, over the next few months, we'll work our way through the swaps and I'll do wee videos and do my version of some of these gorgeous gifts. I'm really curious to see what's in here, look. It says, thank you for being so sweet and I'm really missing this paper already but it's gone don't know if I can get into this mm. what do you think might be in here 
Let's see, there's paper to tell me. I can sort of I can remember getting this, but it's not. Right, I'll have to undo. So they've dyed the white linen ribbon. Can you see okay? Um, camera's all out of sync, but you know, you can spend all day trying to get that sort of thing right. So we have Sheila Birch, thank you for swapping with me. What has she got in here? What's oh, a jar of something? Mm. <gasps> wow, lemon and gin preserve. Wow, that is fantastic. <laughs> Thank you so much. I'm not, I, I don't think I'm going to try and put that back in there. I'll try. I will, not just now. I'll leave it here just now and I'll sort that after. Fantastic. Putler's Rock. That is superb. This is the team that I was meeting with on Sunday. So, and uh, this is from Little Owl Crafts. Lisa Emsley. Lisa, you are such a fantastic friend. Um, thank you. Lisa is another Scottish demonstrator for a little bit for well, like a lot bit further north than me. Two pencils. How useful is that? And some beautiful designer series paper. What a gorgeous gift to get. Who can't use a pencil? Fantastic. And when I got this, I remember thinking, look at this, how clever is this? The wee dangly, wee dangly bits used with the little flower punches. If you don't have the little flower punches, get them because they're not carrying over to the new catalogue. Now, I remember commenting to the person that gave me this, but can I remember now? I thought at the time, oh, I'll remember, I'll remember. Have you got put details inside? Please tell me you've put your details inside. I don't know what that is. Yeah, there's something inside as well. Explore that. And I want to give a shout out because this is so cute. Oh gosh, it's my friend Heather. Heather, thank you so much. Stamp with Nelly. Look up Stamp with Nelly on Pinterest and YouTube. Wow. What is this a... Is it a lip salve? Oh yeah, why have I took the lid off it? What am I like? Oh, banana. It's a fruity one anyway, I think it's banana. I can't, I can't read it very well, but I think that is gorgeous. Look at the gorgeous little bag and I love the dangly bits, as they say. So, and our, this, um, our label punch is carrying over, thank goodness. Who loves punches? I love all our punches and I'm so glad when they carry over. Heather, thank you so much. Do you know what? I'm going to put this back in because some of my ladies want to get a look at my, my swaps over the weekend. But the ones with sweeties in, I think they'll find that them empty, but never mind. I think I've got quite a few my team ladies and... My, my stamping lady's probably going to pop in for a coffee over the weekend just so they can get a sneak peek at the catalogue. Don't tell anybody. And here we go. Now I know who this is from. This is from Paper Daisy Crafting, Jill Chapman. I spent quite a bit of time at the weekend with Jill. Um, Jill was staying in the same hotel as I was and very kindly gave myself and Karen so a lift to the conference and made our lives so much simpler. Um, it is easy to get around, but um, it was so much easier when we got offered a lift. So thank you so much for that, Jill. It's one of our beautiful wee boxes again. I'm not sure if they're carrying over to the new catalogue but they're certainly in the current catalogue so if you want any of these little treat boxes 
get in touch, get um, your order in soon because they, you know, if they're not carrying over, then they'll go fast. And this beautiful ribbon, this is not carrying over. None, very few of the ribbons are carrying over. So you, we've got a brand new variety of ribbons coming up for you. So, um. This this is not carrying. It was gorgeous. This one I've got the red one, but I love the daffodil yellow one as well. And again, Jill's shoes are wee punchies again, and our layering circle dies. Happy Easter! And she's she's used the, our letters, our make a difference letters, to um, get Easter there. So. Thank you, Jill. That's fantastic. Thanks for all your help getting around and for your company. Um, uh, what's next? We've got a covered notebook here and a wee kinder bar from my lovely friend Violet. Thank you so much, Violet. Didn't get a lot of time with you, Violet. Um, it was all so busy, wasn't it? But... Um, We'll catch up with you again, Violet. It's good to see you looking well. And I just love, love this beautiful, beautiful set. Again, this paper's not carrying over. And neither is the stamp set. If you want that, get it ordered now because it is gorgeous. Gorgeous, gorgeous. I don't know about that punch. Um, let me have a quick look without telling you. I can't let you see in, but I can have a quick look to see if the, that punch, because it is nice. Yes, the Twinkle Builder punch is carrying over, and so is the Cake Builder punch. So, you know, that we saw earlier, it's, it is carrying over. Um, yeah. Can't let you see inside, sorry. Isn't this a cutie? Look, a wee rabbit. He's got his wee carrot and his wee tail on the back. How cute is that? Now, can we get in? Yep. I don't like it if I have to destroy a spot. And it's got some gorgeous little wee eggs in. Oh, Linda Worth, thank you very much. Lilocrafts.co.uk Check out Lilo, uh, Linda's blog there, Lilo Crafts. Lovely wee eggs. Three fits in. It's so cute. It's a cute little box. And I just love the way she stuck this on to the, the foldy in, but will I be able to do it again? Pro yes, I can. That's really clever. Okay. And it's such a cute little box. So there you go, our little arms. I think she's probably used the banner punch to get the arms round her wee box. Not uh, from the the rabbit punch to get that, but I think fabulous. I just love how he's hugging his carrot to him. Right, he's gorgeous. Here we go, another one, and this is from my friend Elizabeth Thompson. She's also a Scottish demonstrator. Doesn't live too far from me. Thank you, Elizabeth. These are gorgeous. Just lovely. Oh, look, cutesy. I never ever got round to getting the set with the octopus and it's definitely not carrying over so if this is one that you like and you haven't got round to get and get it straight away so behold the swap to pass very clever very clever and it tells you all the items that were in there and Karen Howell Karen is a one of our Welsh demonstrators and she is tuppence coloured if you look her up on YouTube and on Pinterest and her blog is if you if you type in tuppence coloured dot co dot uk you will find her. Okay. She does some beautiful projects so do look her up and what she put in here. Some gorgeous bits and pieces. A wee, a wee fresh, a wee freshener. How lovely! That's a great idea. A super thing to have in your handbag. That is lovely. I love the way this is all folded up and the little treat popped inside. Thank you so much. Now I'm wishing I had got that octopus. <laughs> I never got round to it. Can't have everything. 
<laughs> lovely business card, Karen. I'm going to pop it that way round so that, oops, so I remember it. I'm having to try and put them all back because, as I say, my ladies like to come and see all what I bring back. Hopefully some of them will come with me next year. Some of my new team people. So what have we got here? Oh my goodness. A pile of goodies, but no name. Oh, if it was you that gave me this beautiful wee pack of loveliness. Now, I remember speaking to someone, but there's no details. Lovely wee pegs, a couple of wee water balloons, and some sweeties. What a gorgeous little collection! That is so sweet, but I don't know who you are, so I can't give you a shout out. But again, these punches are carrying over. It's so pretty. Thank I remember speaking to you, but I can't. I can't know. I cannot remember. So please, if, if you know who made this, or if it was you indeed, let me know and I will give you a shout out somewhere. I love that. Here we go. Wow, a sparkly nail varnish in a beautiful package. How lovely is that? It's a gift for any girl. And where are your details? Is it in here? I don't know who's... I think there might be. How do I get in though? No, there's no details in here at all of who's done that. If this was your, if this was you, let me know because I just think that's beautiful and I love this paper. I'm going to miss this paper, but do you know what? There's so many exciting papers come coming on you, or you're going to be blown away by them. They're just fabulous. So a nice sparkly nail varnish, nail, nail, nail file, goodness me, my head's somewhere else. And some bookmarks for my new catalogue, how superb are they? So this is from Angelina, Angelina is in tatwinedesigns.co.uk Go and have a look at Angelina's work, just put an int intertwine with a Y designs and Angelina will come up, she does some amazing projects. These are so handy, these little bookmarks. We have... Who's given me this? They're not telling. They're not telling. Let's have a look in. A beautiful little envelope anyway. Let's see if we put the details in. Gorgeous little rabbit. I never had that one. But see these two punches, they're just fabulous. We scallop punches. If you don't have them get them but they are carrying over so you don't have to do it in a rush easter greetings oh and there's these fable friends and this is done all with lemon lime twist remember that gala gingham paper again that's not carrying over so if you need more of that get to order well this is from karen kilner thank you karen kk card craft so look up karen KK Card Craft and uh, you'll see some of her work too. She has a blog. KK Card Craft. It's got a nice ring to it, hasn't it? Have a look. Oops, that's really clever, Karen. I'm going to have to copy these. I wouldn't have to um, think up any designs all you know. I'll just copy all these and do them with the new, the new papers and the new stamps. Yep, that'll save my brain. I always put my own spin on things as well. There you go. That's really superb. Love it. And it's a treat being friends with you. It's a real treat being friends with you. Thank you. It's a treat being friends with all of you. And this is Inky Butterfly. I know who Inky Butterfly is, but it's not coming to me right now. Oh my gosh. <laughs> oh, I'm getting old. It's terrible. I'm having a peek in anyway. Oh, a lovely lip balm, a Vaseline lip balm. Oh, my goodness. I <laughs> I'm struggling. Is it you, Verity? Somebody let me know who's Inky Butterfly. Don't press. 
<laughs> anyway, have a wee look. I'll have to look up your blog to remember who who works under Inky Butterfly. I'm taking ages and I've still got another whole basket, which was even fuller than this one. Oh, I'm sorry, this has been a bit squashed. What a neat box this is. How am I going to get into I have to take the yeah, take the lovely twine, which is carrying over, so you're okay with that. This paper's not, though, if you want to get yourself another pack of this, I would hurry. Oh, more chocolate. Oh, Pootlers like chocolate. Karen Taylor, Modi Paper Crafts. Thank you, Karen, and it was a delight to meet you this weekend. Um, and this Share What You Love designer series paper. Get in there. The, the stamp here, these stamps are staying, the Rooted in Nature and the Pop of Petals. They're staying in the new catalogue, but seriously, if you love this paper, share what you love. Get yourself another pack ordered up, honestly. It's gorgeous. I'll pop this back in there. Now, there's not a hope I'm going to get that back on, is there? Is there? Maybe. Maybe, maybe, maybe. I did! Wow! <laughs> well done, me. And here we go. From Heidi. It is a wee bit scuffed, but do you know what? Heidi had done all her swapping when I found her and I was telling her I was admiring her swap. And she dug to the bottom of her bag and pulled this one out for me just so that I could share with you. How fabulous is this? Now, I know when I undo this, there's not a chance I'll get it back together. Because I'm just too dim for that. But I just love it. I'll have to watch your video or something, Heidi, till you show me how to put this back together. And it's got Tic Tacs in it. I know I got one of these from someone last year and it's still open. I've still not worked out, but I really will try and work this one out. Thank you so much, Heidi, for swapping with me. Flutterbyheidi.co.uk. I'm going to have to watch to see how to put this back together again. Um... Oh my gosh. <laughs> I love it. I love the wee tic tacs too. I will try later. But just look at the job she's made of these butterflies. Aren't they beautiful? Looks like she's watercolored them. It is just gorgeous. Maybe sponged. I'm not sure, but I'm sure if we if we all go and look up Heidi's Do you know what's happened here? Is one of the wee baby I think she's had a baby butterfly on there and it's just come off. Um but no, there's no way I can put this back Heidi help 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 me if you can <laughs> mm, that should be inside what's the chance it's... no not right anyway nearly but not quite what else have we got here gosh celebrate I take ages I've got another lot. I might have to do swaps part two because this is going to be really long. So celebrate. Again, these gorgeous little punches and that beautiful ribbon that was in the spring summer catalogue. I think there might be still some of that left. Definitely not carrying over and it is just so pretty. Calypso coral satin ribbon it is. That is gorgeous. I'm not sure what stamp set that is. The wee flower and the celebrate oh and a beautiful wee candle let's see who gave me this storm stamping cast shears it was gorgeous it was great to meet you Cass um talk to you plenty on social media but lovely to meet you my goodness you've lost lots of different things there it's quite scary sometimes so it's a, yeah so there's a big list there. If you want to know any, just get in touch with me and I'll let you know. So it looks like this um, is from the Time time for Tea stamp set. Which of, are, is Time for Tea? No, Tea Together's coming over, but Time for Tea's not. So if you want the Time for Tea one, get it now while stocks last. Because the retiring list is out and things will disappear. Lovely wee candle. Thank you so much, Cass. I love all these cutesy wee boxes. I don't do enough dinky stuff myself. I did one, if you look back, that I do have one video that I 
cased from Pootles, but um, there you go. That is so pretty. And I received this beautiful envelope from Pootles who was running the Sunday event. Look at this beautiful ribbon again, not carrying over, so if you like it. And she says, you can move mountains. So I've been trying to lose weight and I have been talking to her about it. I wonder if that's what she was referring to. I'm sure it's not. I'm sure it's not. It's just a good motivating statement. But um, I do need to move mountains. So And this Beauty Abound stamp, it's carrying over. So that's fantastic, isn't it? Tell me if I'm wrong, anyone. Oh, I think it is. Do you know, I've only, yeah, Beauty Abounds is carrying over. I've only got about half a dozen stamp sets but well, that's not quite true anyway in here Sam gifted everybody a little gift so my gift was these gorgeous sweet elements these sweet they're like me paper clips again they're in the catalogue and these um, gift tags I need to be using them they're in the catalogue they're not carrying over so get in there and get them ordered up if you want them and again I'm so sad to tell you but our gold library clips they are not carrying over there are some things that there's something maybe not quite as big as this but there's something similar coming however not these I totally love these can't remember what we had before then but I totally love them and um, get stocked up get stocked up before they disappear I wouldn't delay because things are now getting to the stages while stocks last. So you just need to get an order in for all the things in the annual catalogue and the spring summer catalogue that you want to have. So thank you Sam for that. I really appreciate it. And during the activity we did an activity we did and she gave spot prizes I think she gave everybody something actually in the end so I got these beautiful wax elements floral romance seals aren't they fantastic so again they're in the annual catalogue get them ordered they're not carrying over look at this cute little box how pretty is that these this punch is carrying over and that ribbon's not so and neither is the paper. It is just beautiful. Can I get in? Not letting me in. That's it. I'm in now. How pretty. So reinforced. Oh look, a heart. And who's this from? Oh it's Kayla. Kayla. Kayla love. Kayla's crafty creation. So have a look for Kayla's have a look for Kayla's work. Now last year Kayla gave me a, a, the swap I got from Kayla is a little handbag and I totally love it as well. Thank you Kayla and I just love these butterflies beautifully coloured and look lovely wee diamantes on top. Just beautiful, thank you. That is the first box. Here is, I've not finished this yet but it was a swap. Sally did a swap she did a make and take on Sunday and I haven't quite finished mine yet but what she gave us enough to make more than one so what I'm going to do I'm going to do a video and show you how I made Sally's swap later so that's box one done and here's box two which do you know what I'm going to do a part two and do do another video because this is too long you can't really sit and watch forever and ever so thank you very much for sticking with this there will be a part two um don't forget to subscribe and share to anyone who want might want to look at this absolute feast of ideas and things that you can case and just lots of wee ideas of things we can make with our Stampin' Up! products. Thank you so much. Speak to you very soon.